it's uh, lovely to have uh, Leila with us. She's not just going to talk about the Gaza kitchen. Uh, she's going to talk about other things, but our books are there for sale, so please um, do have a look. So without any further ado, I'll hand over to Leila. <coughs> Thank you talk, so and, much. Uh, we'll have some time for questions. Yeah, I'll try to make it short so I won't bore everyone, and then we can do an intimate Q&A, perhaps. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. So, yeah, actually what I was going to be, I was told to be speaking mainly about was this, um, this new book that I, that I um, edited along with my co-editor in Gaza, Rifat al and it's called Gaza Unsilenced. And, um, and it's basically a, um, it's an anthology, it's a collection of, um, of essays and poems and some photographs and, and analysis specifically about last year's invasion, uh, Protective Edge, and then giving as well reference and context about Gaza in general. Uh, I, I can also speak obviously about the Gaza kitchen because I'm sure people will be curious about that. I'm happy to do that perhaps, you know, in the end. Um, but I, you know, a lot of a lot of what I talk about obviously is is Gaza as a whole, and you know that kind of overlaps. But um, just a little bit about the uh, anthology. We felt it was really important to be able to have sort of a reference book of material that was largely, not exclusively, but largely written, contributed to by Palestinians, not only in Gaza, but, but uh, in Diaspora, the West Bank, um, in the Galilee, to be able to have kind of a comprehensive uh, um, volume of voices representing Palestinians from all over, to be able to speak to why. So we, we felt it important to be able to provide this narration of the Palestinian struggle um, through, you know, not only eyes that have witnessed or experienced it, but, but others, um, through, who I, I really like the term um, that a Palestinian in Edinburgh used, um, experiencing my distant war, for those who lived abroad as well, as well as other Palestinians, how it affected them, how they are viewing it, how this struggle is linked and associated to theirs. Yeah.